Assalamu alaikum my dear students I hope that you will be fine at home and today of class 11th subject history today we will discuss the what was the progress of science during the times of renaissance or period of renaissance we have learned before that how uh, humanism was uh, progressed during the times of the renaissance and similarly art and architectural developments and we know that the scholars like martin luther king of germany raised their voice against the catholic church and papacy and now today we will discuss how science was progressed during times of renaissance now you are familiar that the monks are popes the monks are popes are clergymen of catholic church in italy they were familiar with the works of greek as you are familiar that greek were the great lovers of learning writing Similarly, just like Mongols were the lovers of uh, wars. Similarly, we find that the Greeks were not the lovers of wars or battles, but they were the lovers of seeking knowledge in nature. Thus, they have great scholars like we find that um, they were Aristo. and plato plato and aristotle they were the great philosophers of greek but you are familiar that these monks as clergies they did not left them these their knowledge which they have get known to other people the knowledge which they got from these philosophers of greek they did not share this knowledge for their selfish interest to the common people and they wanted that they should not know about this knowledge but by 14th century many scholars started to read the translation of greek writers the greek writers who was one scam into the uh, uh, into the colony of arabs they, these the arabs they were translated these they were also translated the works of plato and aristotle in their arabic language in their arabic language and also persian but the persian and arabic scholars works in european language also these works were on the natural sciences the works which arabs have they were natural sciences mathematics mathematics similarly the uh, their works were on based on astrology astrology astronomy astronomy and we also find chemistry the arabs were having great scholars like mathematics astrology astronomy and chemistry and medicine science and we find that they were uh, the works of ptolemy and aristotle were also um, um, they were translated into arabic language these works were on natural sciences mathematics astrology astronomy and chemistry The Alme Guest of Ptolemy was the work of 140 C. 
on all which shows connection with Iraq. His book, his book uh, on astronomy in Greek language was translated into Arabic. Ptolemy's work on al Megist was translated into Arabic. It carried in Arabic alphabets. This work was carried on Arabic alphabets. Alphabets, which shows connection with Arabs. This book shows the connection of Greeks with Arabs, just like the great scholars, thinkers of uh, Muslims were Arabs, were Ibn Sina, Ibn Sina, a best physician, Arab physician. Similarly. Philosophy. He was he was a philosopher of Bukhara. Bukhara is a place in Arabia. While Ibn Sina, one of the greatest renowned renowned um, philosopher, belongs to. And Al Razi, the author of medical encyclopedia. Al Razi. He was. The author of medieval encyclopedia were considered the men of knowledge in Italian cities. They were the great. Uh, they were the great. There were we find other great philosophers, thinkers, um, scientists in Ar Arabia. Ibn Sina al Idrisi, and more. The Christian thinkers adopted the method of Arab philosophers of Spain, Ibn Rashid. The Christian thinkers adopted the method of Arab philosopher of Spain, Ibn Rashid. Ibn Rashid, who set out to resolve the tension between philosophical knowledge and religious fact. Ibn Rashid won't try his best to uh, end the tension and the tension between philosophical philosophical and philosophical knowledge and a religious fact. He wanted to make an end of these to knowledge and similarly these uh, thinkers um, uh, especially the renaissance thinkers they translated these books into their common language so that the ordinary people became now about the philosophy of Aristotle and um, Plato and also many other great scholars of Arabia. In this way, the books were translated, and these books reached uh, every common man so that they were became able to know how the progress will be placed in the field of whether it is medical science or natural science or mathematics, etc. Thus, at the conclusion, we can say that during the time of Renaissance, not only political, not we not find only that political growth was taken place, but we find that the development was taken place in various fields of life, especially that was mathematics, astrology, astronomy, and many more. This comes from Arabia and Greeks, the works of Greeks and the works of Arab scholars were translated, and in this way we find that the European nation developed tremendously uh, because these books came into their hands. And the, on the other side, the religious dogma was ended in the 14th century in Europe. Thank you. This was our today's topic.